We're here, stage three, Lake Fork Bass Pro Tour. And today was day one of practice. I actually just come in and uh, about to put the boat back on the trailer. We are at the bass capital of the world here. I mean, everybody knows Lake Fork. I mean, there's tremendous fish here. You gotta feel good if you're at Lake Fork, right? It's like home of giant bass and uh, big fish. Looking for big fish for stage three, the Bass Pro Tour. Picking up after day one of practice. And uh, we're on a big fish lake. They, they live here, they grow them here. Texas does a good job. And they live here, we know that. But big fish doesn't, that don't mean easy fishing. I believe some records are gonna go down because when you find some fish, they're grouped up and they're big. So I'm excited to get out there tomorrow, explore some more and get ready for, uh, to, tomorrow's the last day. We get two days of practice and we'll see what happens. Everything's changing. It's springtime of the year. Uh, I would think that the shallow water bite would probably be dominant, but I would also think that the offshore bite uh, somebody could, you know, stumble upon something and have a really, really big day. Being springtime, there's so many different things that guys could do to win this tournament. And my first guess probably would just be some type of shallow deal. You know, the fish are moving in to spawn. There are definitely plenty of fish that haven't spawned and will not spawn this week. I mean, it's going to go on for a couple months down here in Texas. But I think getting around some of the spawning fish, um, some of those fresh fish moving up, it's going to be a big deal. You know, coming into this, I wasn't real sure just what stage these fish would be in as far as, you know, spawn, pre-spawn, just kind of where they're at. And to be honest, I'm still not 100% sure other than I do know some fish are spawning already. Um, there's got to be some that aren't, um, but I, I really wasn't able to get any kind of a pre-spawn deal going today. You know, we are clearly coming up on the spawn. It, it's March down here, water temps, you know, getting real close to 60 degrees. Uh, you know, it's going to be something based around the spawn. Now we got big rains coming, so that could be the uh, the, the variable there that could hurt things. If we'd have good, nice, nice, good weather, there'd definitely be some bedding fish caught, but uh, it's gonna be fish that, that are either pre-spawn or spawning fish, and, and they're gonna be really close to those key areas where those fish will spawn. I thought it was gonna be really, really dirt shallow. Um, thought they were gonna be coming, and I think they will. I don't know if you'll win doing it. I think the guy that's just out just a little bit, not real far, but just a little bit, and catches them coming in, um, I think we're going to get some weather, and I think that's going to change it a little bit up shallow. So I'm, uh, I'm, I think the guy that keys just a hair off the bank is going to uh, going to put it away this week. Looking at, at techniques and tactics to win this tournament, I think it's going to be one of two things. You either go find a pattern and, and catch big ones, you know, catch pre-spawners, find a spot where you're coming in, maybe catch a school and, and, and just have a classic Lake Fork day. Or I think you could, this is the kind of place too where you won't catch any big ones. You know, you catch a bunch of threes and fours and, and you can go about it that way. I can go ahead and tell you that's where it's gonna be won. Someone's gonna pull up on a point, a rock pile, a magic tree, and they're gonna catch, you know, seven pounder, eight pounder, nine pounder, it's gonna happen. Fish are in a lot of transition right now. I mean, it's springtime of the year, things are warming up, trees are budding, things are looking up. So, uh, you know, hopefully, uh, the guy, and myself included, will figure it out as the week goes along. You know, to do well here, I think as this week goes on, I think more and more fish are going to pull up and, and be spawning, honestly, just as time goes. It's going to be a decent week. Um, Temperature-wise, we're going to deal with some rain. Shocker there. But uh, but I do think that, you know, spawning fish are going to play a, play a role for whoever wins this week. Uh, you know, the winner of this tournament, hopefully, is me. So uh, hopefully, I'm going to be fishing shallow using some, some kind of moving bait, topping it off with a little bit of flipping as well. So the winner of this tournament, I think is going to be fishing six to 10, maybe 12 foot and cranking. I think the guy's going to be cranking. I think he's going to be six to 10 foot.